Top 30 Oliver Reed Movies Welcome, cinephiles, to a special countdown of the Top 30 Oliver Reed Movies. From Hammer Horror Classics to Epic Adventures, Oliver Reed's career was nothing short of extraordinary. Let's dive right into our list, starting with number 30. Number 30, kicking off our countdown at number 30 is The Triple Echo, 1972, a film that showcases the early talents of Oliver Reed. Number 29, in the 29th spot, It's Funny Bones, 1995, where Reed delivered a memorable performance in this dark comedy. Number 28, at number 28, we have The Prince and the Pauper, 1977, a classic adaptation where Reed played the role of Miles Hendon. Number 27 coming in at 27th place, It's the Girl in the Red Velvet Swing, 1955, where a young Oliver Reed made one of his earliest screen appearances. Number 26 The 26th spot goes to I'll Never Forget What's His Name, 1967, a satirical comedy where Reed showcased his unique charm. Number 25 In 25th place, It's The Party's Over, 1965, a thought-provoking drama that displayed Reed's acting prowess. Number 24 Taking the 24th spot is The System, 1964, a drama where Reed delivered a solid performance. Number 23 At number 23, It's Sword of Sherwood Forest, 1960, from Hammer Films, with Reed in a swashbuckling role. Number 22 The 22nd place goes to The Damned, 1963, from Hammer Films, a gripping sci-fi thriller with Reed in a memorable role. Number 21 In the 21st spot, we have Captain Clegg, 1962, another Hammer classic featuring Reed in a pirate-themed story. Number 20 at number 20, It's the Pirates of Blood River, 1962, from Hammer Films, a swashbuckling adventure with Reed in a prominent role. Number 19 in the 19th position, It's Paranoiac, 1963, from Hammer Films, a suspenseful thriller with Reed's captivating performance. Number 18 the 18th spot is reserved for The Two Faces of Dr. Jekyll, 1960, from Hammer Films, where Reed played a pivotal part. Number 17 taking the 17th place is The Jokers, 1967, a comedy where Reed's versatility as an actor shines. Number 16 in 16th place, it's Castaway, 1986, where Reed portrayed the resourceful and resilient Gerald Kingsland. Number 15 Number 15 goes to Hannibal Brooks, 1969, a war comedy where Reed starred as a prisoner of war on an unusual mission. Number 14 At number 14, It's Burnt Offerings, 1976, a chilling tale where Reed's performance adds to the film's eerie ambience. Oh number 13 The 13th spot is reserved for The Shuttered Room, 1967, a suspenseful thriller with Reed in a leading role. Number 12 In the 12th position, It's The Hunting Party, 1971, a suspenseful western with Reed in a memorable role. Number 11 taking the 11th spot is The Assassination Bureau, 1969, where Reed portrayed a dashing assassin in this delightful romp. Number 10, at number 10, we have Women in Love, 1969, a D.H. Lawrence adaptation that showcased Reed's acting talent. Number 9 in the 9th place, It's the Devils, 1971, a controversial and powerful film where Reed's performance is truly electrifying. Number 8 The eighth spot goes to The Brood, 1979, a chilling horror film with Reed's unforgettable performance. Number 7 At number 7, It's The Trap, 1966, a gripping adventure film where Reed portrayed Jean Larbet. Number 6 Taking the sixth spot is Tommy, 1975, where Reed played the memorable role of Tommy's stepfather. Number 5 In fifth place, It's The Four Musketeers, 1974, a thrilling sequel to The Three Musketeers where Reed excelled as Atos. Number 4 The fourth spot is reserved for The Three Musketeers, 1973, where Reed portrayed the heroic Atos in this epic adventure. Number 3 Coming in at number 3, It's Oliver. 1968, a classic adaptation where Reed took on the menacing role of Bill Sykes. Number 2 At number 2, It's Gladiator, 2000, his last role the epic where Reed played Proximo, leaving an unforgettable mark on the film. Reed died during the making of the movie. Number 1 and finally, 
Taking the top spot in our countdown is The Curse of the Werewolf, 1961, from Hammer Films, where Reed's portrayal of the cursed lycanthrope is truly unforgettable. There you have it, movie aficionados. The top 30 Oliver Reed movies, each a masterpiece in its own right. Oliver Reed's cinematic legacy is one to be celebrated, and these films are a testament to his enduring talent. Be sure to like, subscribe, and let us know in the comments which Oliver Reed movie is your favorite. Thanks for joining us on this journey through his incredible filmography. See you in the next countdown video. The curse of the werewolf that was laid on a baby who grew into a man possessed by a monster. To this Spanish town, the night brought drinking and dancing, music and girls, and the moon. The full moon that turned an innocent man into a savage beast. The curse of the werewolf, a man possessed by a desperate need for love, who found in Christina all the passionate sincerity of youth. Christina, do you love me? Will you marry me, Christina? You say you love me, but will you marry me? Yes. Yes, I will. Yeah.